This brand new Dragon Ball game may have only come out less than a week ago now, but it's already facing one massive problem that has everybody complaining. And that problem is the color green. Let's just hope he doesn't have another in his hand. He fucking has enough. Of course he does. God, I hate this fucking card so much. This color just has a ton of strong options in this game. And most of all, they have some of the best leaders. One of my favorites, of course, being the Android. So in this video, I'm going to jump into some rank matches and show off just what makes this deck so dominant when it comes to fusion warriors and show off some examples for the androids of why I think they're the best. So here we've got my androids or at least just Android 17 going up against another green deck in Broly. So this should be a late game extraordinaire. And this is a decent hand i'm just gonna go ahead and keep it i'm gonna be touching on the basics of this game as we go along just because i know it's still new i know there's still people that's gonna be confused i can't believe we went second he gets a free energy so out of all the cards i could possibly charge to gain energy i'm gonna go with 17 and 18 just because i do have a 16 card in here that benefits for that other than that we're gonna spend that one energy to get this green goku get a free little draw and because i went first that's literally all i can do which is not very fun for me hopefully though he does take this time to attack us us, I would be happy with that because then we get to draw one of our live cards and again in a green match That's that's no big deal Broly went ahead and played Moa, who is just a searcher for Paragus, and that's really going to start Broly's whole shtick. I feel like Paragus is one of the best. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Swing on me, bro. Swing on me. Make my day. Make my day. Give me that draw. Got him. Oh, another SR18, my alt art version. Look at this art. I got I to gotta get more cards in this game because I want to play more of these alt arts. That being said, I am not trying to get any more cards until the uh, the phase here. Um, Wow. I mean, that could be pretty good. I might save that. I think I might just charge the 18 for now. But if I draw into a 17, I would really like to keep that. So I'm actually going to charge the Turlis. No, 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 no. Let's not be crazy here. Let's not be crazy here. I'm going to charge. I'm going to charge the 18. We're we're not going to draw into a 17. There's no reason to play like that. And now let's just go ahead and play the SR18. Two drop 18. We get a draw one and then a discard one. Ooh. Hmm. I feel like we should save the Goku because we don't have a three play right now. So it might be time to discard. We might have to discard the Turles. And in this case, I would have rather charged the Turles. So this is kind of wild. Oh, we could discard the Broly. Do we think we're getting to eight energy? Yeah, I do. I think we're getting to eight energy this game. I'll discard. I'll discard Turles. It's fine. It's genuinely fine. Now we're going to put the pressure on, though. I'm going to attack with, with just 17 because that's the only card we can draw right now. And we'll just step in. Ooh, we actually did get a three drop blocker. I think we should play that. I think we should play that. This is the 16 card I was talking about. So this 16, if you read his permanent effect, if you have Android 17 and 18 in your energy area, this card gets 10,000 power. Now that's only on my opponent's turn, but as a blocker, that's really all we need him for. He's actually going to defend that. I'm totally cool with that. Bro, if you want to play late game, let's play late game. Once we get to six energy as well, this 18 will also draw us a card every time she attacks so that's also huge oh he's got he had the stack card he had the stack broly card he got an extra energy and now he has a blocker uh we just take this we, we need to start getting our card advantage up i feel like he's gonna win the energy game with that play he just did yeah we gotta take this try to push us to our awakening i feel like we have to get a little risky early if we're gonna win the big thing at the end here all right but now we actually have a chance for a pretty big play so i'm going to charge this uh but i could threaten that pretty easily right now we're gonna charge the goku i don't think there's ever gonna be a time in this game where goku's gonna fit nicely into our play do we want to play the blocker now or do we want to threaten? I think we play the blocker now just so he can't get ahead of us on this stuff. But this is still fine. We're just going to go. We're going to go for the attack just to draw. All right, we got nice. We got another Goku anyway. So with the attack with 17, we get to draw a card. If he lets it go through or not, I'm not really sweating about it. In fact, it doesn't mean much to me. Nice, we'll take it. We could threaten another attack, but I don't necessarily want him to draw that much. But I mean, it could be pretty nice. No, no, I don't, I don't think we threaten it. I don't think we threaten that just yet. Let's get a crit here. Look at this 30,016 just because I got 18 and 17 in the energy. Bro is beefy. He's blocking leaders at this point. Legendary Super Saiyan or just a big eight foot tall android. You let me know which one you think is winning. I got my money on 16. Now that we are getting into the later stages of this game. Oh, another search. Yeah, go ahead. Search your Paragus, bro. Something tells me that's all the energy you got. Where did all your energy go? He added another energy. Oh, no. Oh, all right. Yeah, this is where we're going to start blocking. Actually, no, let me take that. No, 
I mean, I might as well block, right? I might as well block. Let's just block it out. We don't really need to draw any cards right now. Wow, he's going up to 5,000? Okay, he's gonna kick. Whoa, whoa, man, that was a lot of resources for 16. And that put him at 20, so he's literally only at 35,000. Why would I not just... Honestly, I might double Goku it up. I might double Goku it up. Double Goku seems like a pretty good play right now. I mean, if he spent all those resources, stopping him there seems like a really good deal for me. I could be wrong. Again, I'm learning the game still, but all those resources not to even get eight, a 16 off the table, that seems pretty bad, especially when he's coming right. Oh, I got another 16 anyway. Mm, as far as who we want to charge here, I think we might just charge. Wow, I could... I could... <laughs> We have to start winning the energy game, huh? Having another blocker 16 might go kind of crazy, but it's also not super necessary. All right, we're just gonna get rid of the Android 17. He doesn't do enough for us right now, and I, we do have to start winning this energy game, so we are gonna go with Vegeta. Vegeta is gonna come out here. We're not really worried about his blocker. I'm not gonna use the effect. Turles, go ahead, sit on that energy bench thanks to Vegeta. Now we're also at five, and which almost gets us to the point where 18's about to start popping off, dude. Oh, and we do draw a Turles. That's huge. That's a great five draw. Life has never felt so good. All right, he blocks. That's honestly perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. Now we get to draw a card without letting him draw one. I'm feeling pretty good on that. So we're even in energy, all things considered. I mean, he's one ahead of us technically, but we're going first. I don't think this is too bad. And we've got plays. Let me tell you, we got plays right now. We got some absolute plays. Getting a Turles out is going to help us get our energy up even more. But I do have to combo a card here, three or more. So I have to, I have to get something in the graveyard here for Turles to really be worthy of dropping right now. Oh, brother, here comes the Paragus spam, bro. Oh, here comes the Paragus spam. Ooh, uh, yeah, we just blocked that. We just blocked that, bro. You gonna you gonna spend more cards for this? <laughs> I might. I maybe should have considered letting him just attack us, though. Gigantic meteor for this? For this that only boosted you up to forty k. Damn, bro. I mean, I guess you kind of got it. Although I want to play Turles to threaten. So honestly, what we could do is just eighteen it up. Like we could. We could just drop another 16 and 18 and not play Turles right now. And then this 16, we can fish back with Turles. So this is fine. That was too many resources. I think that's way too many. All the Paraguses, you can take the goddamn 16. <laughs> My turn. All right, so we do have a fish out with... I mean, we just we just charge this. This is useless. All right, so now we actually do have a fish out with Turles. So we can go a little crazy here, but we're also at six energy. So I can draw a lot of cards and I don't think we need necessarily need a blocker right now. So I think we're just gonna go all out here. And also I can just play a blocker. So never mind. This is about to get, this is about to get disgusting here in a second. Just discard the Goku. I could also threaten a crit. Like we could really make a play for it right now. We could really make a play for it right now, but I mean, this is the only time this 17 is ever gonna be useful. I'm Unless I just want to use him for combo power. The crit is pretty good, but I guess I'd rather have a blocker, right? I guess I'd rather have a 16 blocker. All right, let's draw some goddamn cards, though. Six energy? Yeah, we're going to draw one. Ooh, easy 17. The androids are... This is full power androids right now. Two SR18s? Yeah, we're going to be drawing some goddamn cards here in a second. Blocker's about to get out of here. See ya. Bye-bye. Who cares? Now we're going to draw another card with this 18 over here. Boom. Plus two already for the turn. And then I probably shouldn't attack but I mean, we also draw another card with this. So there we go. All, wow, we got a lot of the 17s, huh? So now he's at five. He's still outside of that transformation range. I could just punch him with uh, Vegeta, but I kind of want to leave him outside of that transformation range anyway. And he can't even get to either of the 18s because we still have Broly there. This is crazy. Honestly, just from a card balancing standpoint, I think they gave this 18 way too much attack. <laughs> There's Turles, but we're not really too afraid of that. We just block on Turles because he does have crit. We're going to be playing our Turles next turn anyway. Anyway, just a random one drop Vegeta. Okay, now we know he's at option. Honestly, I would have kept that in the hand for the combo power. 10k? 10k combo power is pretty nice to have around late game. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna activate the skill. I feel like that's a bad call. 30,000? You could have used that on anything. We block with that and we do die here. He didn't even need to do... Okay, he might be... I think he's just new to the game. Or he wanted to guarantee it died, but I don't think spending that resource was super wise. Now, yes, he gets the swing, but he's still too low to kill any of the 18s. This this is looking a little bit is looking a little bit cooked here. And we get another 18. Wow. 
Wow. That kind of... That's kind of crazy. And there's the Broly for next turn. Holy moly, dude. This is kind of crazy. I mean, let's start things off with the Turles. This is going to leave us with two energy. Turles gets the search. Now we get an extra energy. So that's already the three we need. And then another SR18. Why not? Why not draw three, four cards a turn? This is so cooked. You, this is cooked. I'm just going to get rid of the bad combo power. 30,000 Turles. We are actually... I mean, we could honestly... We could threaten game here. Or I could just draw infinite cards <laughs> and not have to worry about giving him cards. I think that's the play, right? If we're trying to play the long game... Let me do this. Let me do this. We're going to attack the card that we can't even destroy just so we guarantee that we can farm up our cards without necessarily giving him any advantage. But is that... Do I want to do that forever, though? I think I do because I'm pretty much threatening game next turn. And notice how he's saving this blocker, but what he doesn't know is my Vegeta has an effect to discard one destroy. So after I drew those cards, yeah, that card's out of here, buddy. You're not going to be able to, you're going to have to spend some resources in hand to keep Turles alive. And I think I kind of would like to, I mean, the thing is I could, I could make an attempt on this Turles' life with just, uh, let's, 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 let's try the Turles play. Let's keep him out of that wake up range. Let's get him to spend some resources if he wants to keep his Turles so bad. He does 20,000 at this point it might be kind of worth it to just i mean let me attack with this first let me get my draw look at this this is how you build hand advantage by the way <laughs> this is how you build hand advantage max power androids you're not messing with this all right now i think we're gonna make another swing at this turles my vegeta's probably pretty useless at this point especially considering we have another in hand so we're gonna attack and combo in vegeta that puts us at immediate 30k we're instantly threatening so if he has a 5,000, i'd be okay with him spending that i kind of him on the side of like let's just push this up right let's push this up let it make him use something good just in case he does have a 5k in the hand or something oh he didn't he didn't have anything all right well i i still don't feel too bad for committing that resource uh, i was bad but he's got three cards in hand we're gonna play broly next turn so whatever he plays gets destroyed here we'll draw another three and we'll be pushing game at that point it, it's looking pretty over he could draw something nice but with one crit option available i could even play another i could play i mean Damn, I could play another two crits, honestly. Oh, Broly, never mind. We're forced into playing Broly, but that's fine. He's going to destroy Turles here. For sure, that's the correct play. And then probably swing on two of the androids would be my... I mean, I guess that's fine. He could also just swing on Turles. That's interesting. Do I have a response to swing on Turles? I don't think I necessarily do. Uh, I mean, I could combo away two androids because the it's not going to make much sense to keep them now. But I guess, no, I don't have any response to that. No response to that. Do I have a response to this? I'm going to, again, probably say... The thing is, I draw so many I draw so many cards here that it might be worth saving this. <laughs> I draw so many cards that I could save this, and I'd be pretty happy, I think. Yeah, we're just going to save it. 20k, so that's all right. We're already there, and then we'll just add one more. I'm probably going to go with the Vegeta, and that's good enough. Now, his leader can't threaten me. Everything feels pretty good here. Broly can't threaten me. I mean, he can attack, but that this is just going to be better for me, honestly. This puts me in my awakening mode. Dr give me another draw. Now we're at four. We have... Jer I didn't even have Jero's lab this duel. Oh my goodness. Not like it's necessary anymore, but... So now we get to awaken our androids. Get ready for this. <laughs> Yes, sir. And we've got two Brolies in the hand, so you already know the play. We drop a Broly, leaving ourselves with one energy. That's fine. We have a gigantic meteor. Turles just for next turn if we want. All right. And now uh, now we cook. Now we absolutely cook. All right. Android swing. Get us a draw. Pretty good. We just end turn there. He's going to get to draw, but that's fine. Even though this is going to give him a lot of cards, I think this is where we do just start swinging. Didn't want to take the damage. Okay. I don't disagree. I don't disagree. Androids are now at 30,000 power because we have more than six energy. <laughs> How many resources will you spend trying to defend your life? Nothing? Then you're about to get done in my future Gohan, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. It's useless. Three lives left. Now we could double attack with Broly and I kind of think I will. I mean, there's no point in attacking. 
I'm not gonna lie, but maybe it'll threaten him to try to defend himself now. Either way, I think we're pretty much gonna win this duel. That's kind of why I'm, I'm, I'm slowing down on the strategy because honestly, I think I'm just there right now. Like, I think we win. Broly gets to awaken though. It's the legendary Super Saiyan. Why am I not scared, bro? Why, why do I not fear this? Honestly, I could have pushed for game right here. <laughs> I really could have pushed for game right here if I'm being honest. Oh my God, look at all of the cards he has to use just to defend Nat Broly. We definitely could have won the duel right here if I wanted to. If I just dumped all of these cards in, honestly, maybe I... I that was kind of a misplay by me. I, I don't think there's anything he can do to win here. Even if he plays a Broly, he'd be down to one energy. He won't have any options after that. I mean, no, two energy, but I mean, come on. It's not looking too bad. Okay, so there's the Broly. Again, I'm not really super scared of that. So our Broly's dead. Boo-hoo. I'm gonna cry about it, except for the fact that I got another one right here. Ooh, a taunter makes things a little more interesting. He's got to go after the 18. I don't I don't necessarily mind that. I think the 18s have done their job. My hand is at thir no 11 right now. We're, we're, we're chilling. My other 18 is going to unfortunately hit the dust, but that's fine. And then he probably swings on me with Broly. I take it. We draw one and then we're good to go. Whoa, what's this? Oh, just for the draw. Yeah, we take that. We take that. We get an extra card. Broly, go ahead. Do your worst. Ouch. And there's a super guard card. Man, this could not be any worse for this guy. This, <laughs> this is getting pretty bad. And a Gohan searcher just because... But that leaves him with no energy to defend himself. So honestly, that's pretty good for us. All right, my turn. We instantaneously charge Jero's lab. It really matters so little. And now we just play Broly. We play Broly, but gonna be a bit of a mix up here. We're not gonna destroy Broly. We're just gonna destroy the Taunter. I feel like that's that's the actual scary card here. And now we just attack. I mean, honestly, we're gonna start with, uh, we're just gonna start with our leader, to be honest. If he can't do anything to our leader, like he'll have to, you know, we can even just combo in a few. We can combo in 20. 20,000 just to make him make sure to use some cards, but yeah, that's game. <laughs> <laughs> Again, it was it was looking pretty bad for him, but now we can guarantee that it's over. The androids have beaten Broly, and we're on to the next duel. I, you know I gotta run another one. You know I gotta play at least one more. There is no shot that we are once again up against the Broly. This time, though, I'm going all out. Oh, this isn't ooh, this isn't too bad. Got a few SR uh, 18s in here. Two drop 18 again, just a very powerful card in the deck, and we even got a critical facing Android 17. If we do want to try to, you know, move things forward a little bit. I'm a little worried about what we're going to charge here. We need to keep Jero's lab. Jero's lab is always the late game play. And I'm not going second again, man. I don't even get to draw. Oh, going first sucks. All right, we just charged the, we just charged that and end our turn. Going first is so bad, dude. Uh, maybe I'm wrong, but it really feels terrible. Let me talk about what you get going first. So going first, you get to play first. Going second, you get a free energy, you get to draw a card, and you get to attack. Bro, what the hell? Let me go second. All right, well, <laughs> at least going first, I get to get my ass beat, and now he drew another card that I'll probably charge. Damn, he's got the draw one. So far, his early game is much better than mine. I can't even lie. Well, we're just going to charge this. That that guy has too many good abilities. And we'll drop a... Uh, hold on. Do I kind of want to threaten some crits here early on? Why not? Let's threaten some crits here early on. He'll probably absorb Goku. That's what I would do to avoid this crit. Just absorb Goku right here on the field. I think that's the... I think that's the genius play. A true genius absorbs this Goku right here. A true genius combos on the field. Ah! Oh, we're dealing with a true genius. That's fine, though. We get rid of a little resource. He'll probably end up going for the 17, but, you know, that's kind of what you get when you threaten this stuff. Man, looking back, like, why? I know he draw a card, but 18 just has 20,000 points. Why do I ever not 18 there? Just to threaten the critical against the green deck, I guess. But come on, man. Come on, man. This card's too good. This card's too good. I also just get to draw one, discard one. Too good. Just like we said, he's going after my, my 17 here. And honestly, I don't think we want to spend a resource to save this. We could. I mean, it's only 10,000. We could get an 18 in the graveyard. Uh, Getting an 18 in the graveyard is actually not too bad. So yeah, we're going to do that. I forgot this 17 can revive an 18. So not too bad. Let's do that right now just to make sure there's one in there. And I'm feeling pretty good about that. Now, next turn, we're going to Jero's Lab. The turn after that, we 17. We, we're thinking plays in advance. If we're going to beat a green genius, we've got... Did he just... No way way bro 
He just went three for three to add an extra energy. He's, he's playing the ramp up game. He's playing the ramp game, but guess what? So am I. Wow. Wait, hold on. No, no, no. That's, that's terrible. Honestly, that's so terrible. I might charge that. I think we charge that. All right. Let's get our field spell activated. Jero's lab gives us pretty much infinite energy as long as we have an android in the graveyard. Threaten the critical again. Always threaten crit. Why not? Make him spend a resource. He's losing a resource one way or the other. Either you're losing a life off the top or you're losing a card in the hand. You got to pick. Damn, all things considered, though, my, my hand looking a little small, bro. My hand. I don't got the cards for this. A Turles? Damn, we using a Turles for this? I don't know what your hand looks like, so I don't know if I can say I agree. That's a little crazy. A Turles. Wow. I mean, I'll take getting rid of that. We each draw one here, but again, we're going even, so. Is what it is. He's got four energy this turn. I feel bad, dude. The androids in my hand, this card is actually pretty decent, but I always end up charging it because I'm, I never draw it when I need it. I think at this point, he can take this. I think at this point, we have no other option than to just let him take... Actually, a true gamer, I'm afraid that a true gamer might save this. Because if we want a Jero's lab, we need an Android in the grave anyway. So we have the 118 and then we're going to res the other 18. So we need we need another 18 in the graveyard anyway. It's, it's the hard play, but I think it's the play that needed to be made. Ooh, that's not good. He's just gonna he's gonna discard one and blow up our, our 17. But hey, we kept him alive as long as we could, man. We fought the good fight. Yeah, I, I, oh no, he's just gonna attack. Understandable. Understandable. Have a nice day. Understandable. I, I can't I can't keep him alive forever. You know, I'm not gonna be a helicopter parent over here. I I've gotta let him find his own way in the world. Ooh. Alright, we, we instantly charge these guys. Alright, four drop. We play the seven. Wait. Almost did that completely wrong. Activate Jero's lab. Get an android in the graveyard to our energy. We're just going to get you now. All right. Now we play 17. 17 will take one card from our life. And then we get to bring back an 18. <laughs> Draw one, discard one. Ooh. Um. Guess we get rid of this pretty easy. Yeah. Now we have a few plays here. We don't have six energy, so there's no reason to attack with this 18. But we will swing on the Vegeta because the Vegeta threatens 18 if he's alive. Vegeta's ability to discard one, blow up a cost. Uh, I think it's two or less. Cost of two or less does target 18. So we need to keep that alive. Do you spend any resources? I'm coming at this Vegeta full force. I'm not even going to lie. He's going to get swung on 18 if he defends it now. I think he knows that. Let's see if he decides to keep it around. He doesn't. I think that's the smart play. I think that's the smart play. I am just going to attack. Leader on leader. We're fine with that. Uh, step end. We don't want to use 18 because we want to make it as untargetable as possible. The only thing that threatens an active 18, I believe, is a Vegeta or a Broly. And he doesn't have enough energy for a Broly. He does have enough for a Vegeta, though, so... I mean, it is what it is, right? We just have to hope he doesn't have Vegeta here. He's just swinging on me right now, and I'll take that. Let's not let's not spend any resources, obviously. I don't think we want to. We get another Goku. All right, now we have one charge fodder and one just to play. Ooh, the double strike androids immediately is crazy. I forgot the double strike androids also threaten 18. Double strike is a little crazy. Although, to be honest, I think I'm going to let this go through and draw two cards and transform. Okay. All right. Obviously, you don't want to... You never want to see this. You never want to see a double strike on the field that you can't get rid of instantaneously. We charge that. Run the Jero's lab back. Um, let's just do this. Let's keep the good 18s in there. You never want to be in this situation. I think we need to play our blocker now. I think we play our blocker. Yeah. We have to play our blocker just to keep ourselves safe. Let's flip just to draw one. I guess I should have flipped first. Because if I had Broly, things would have changed. 30,000 on our turn probably means I want to try to make an attempt on this android's life, huh? I mean, yikes. Let's play a Goku. Goku to draw one, also 5,000 combo power on board. So we get another Android 16. Let's play another Goku here. A Vegeta as well. We could make an attempt on this AT, but I think they're just too strong to go after offensively like that. Ooh, this is a rough, uh, this is a rough one. This is a rough one. Attacking Broly would just get him in his awakening form, which I'm a little bit afraid of right now. I can't be, I can't lie. What if we do this? What if we swing on 18 and use the Goku's on board to threaten and that's it. We don't use any resources in hand. We just use the Goku's on board and we threaten. We make him spend one resource for it. That might be the best play we had available to us. He uses another Turles. Turles means that they will survive. Ooh, this is going to be a rough one, dude. This is going to be a rough one. Damn, I don't even, I don't know. I don't know. These, these double drop androids are pretty strong. Hopefully I can draw my second pair. Whoa, man. 
a second Android 17 and 18. These guys are stronger than I gave them credit for, bro. Damn. They destroyed three or less, so my blocker immediately gets wiped off the board. Holy. I think the only way we get out of this is with a Broly encounter. I mean, he draws one there, but uh, if he doesn't spend any cards, I guess I'm okay with that. All right, good. We can't. Oh, my God. Gosh, all right, this is gonna be a tough one. I think we need a Broly draw to even hope to win. Double strike at 40K. I mean, this is where we've got to start spending resources. He's got too many cards in hand to ever like meaningfully push for these guys to die here. I think we just take this. I think we take this, try to get as many cards in hand, hope for a Broly. No, double, oh, we needed a Broly. <gasps> no shot, brother. Oh no. <laughs> this is what is known as a not good situation, man. I think we just charge this. Honestly, we probably should have skipped the charge. This is what? This would be at 2,500, so not close to 30. I think the play here is genuinely play Turles, and we have to, we just have to get rid of these guys. Like, uh, we don't have another choice. We have to just go all out. All right, we're going all out. We're using Gigantic Meteor to give us a big swing here. This should put us at, what? 55,000, he would need two cards to get over this. Honestly though, at this point, we, I mean, we really need to push it. He could do it with 20, so I'm gonna combo this Turles, unironically. Combo Turles, he would need to spend a 20,000 thing to beat this. Genuinely though, we need to let this go through. There's no world in which we survive this that we can't, but I need to save the rest for later. So this is 60,000, he would need at least one Super Guard card. I think we wanna go a little bit over that, so I'll combo 117. Hopefully he lets that one slide. I don't think he's gonna let it slide. Oh no, dude, this is a match and a half. I can't believe my Android deck is being thrown. Okay, so we, we did that math. He can't get over it with just that. He needs one more card. Damn, two super cards. Okay, so this is at 40,000, so we threaten it immediately. We're gonna threaten it some more. That still puts us within range to just get blocked immediately. He's already used, how many of these super cards has he already used? One, two, so only two, so he definitely probably has more. He's got five life, so maybe that's, it might be in there. This would only be a 10,000 use case. We need to at least get rid of one, so we have to combo this. All right, step in. So we're at 60, he could play a super guard and match us immediately. He didn't, okay. So now we have to take a real risk here. I could save cards in hand to try to survive so that I can play them next turn, or I can play a blocker, and if he doesn't have another Android, we should be fine. He also gets access to Broly next turn, so I'm cooked. It, uh, I think we play our blocker, and I think we hope he doesn't get insta-destroyed. Does that actually make sense? I feel like that doesn't actually make sense. I don't think it actually makes sense. I think we just end here. We end so we have energy to activate these cards. It's, it's, uh oh man dude what is going on i need broly so bad right now and i needed him like two turns ago i don't even know if he saves us now we're simply re we're bottomed out in resources man it is it okay he instantly goes for the strike that's fine whoa 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 slow your roll all right he's at what 50 60 65 000. 75,000. All right, 75,000. I think we can match that. 75,000. What does this give us? 40. So this would be 50, 60. And then, oh my God. Okay, so we're at 60,000. The only way we get over that is with a super combo. Damn, we left ourselves completely defenseless. <laughs> completely defense. It's, all hope has left my body, bro. There is no hope anymore. There's just no hope anymore, man. We were cooked from the get-go. Damn, the double A. Okay, so the androids are a really good card. I need to run more of the androids, I think. That card is nuts. Yeah, man, you got it, bro. You, Damn, bro, the androids are actually oppressive as hell. And they're a six drop, too. I never give them the credit of being a six drop. Holy. Well, that's the video. Damn, the power of the androids. I wish I got to show it off, but my, I charged them. Damn, that was the wrong decision. I'm pissed. Well, thanks for watching the video. Bye.